Greetings, Entities and Guardians. My name is Hyper Himes, and welcome back to Cooker Run. Well, specifically, Oven Break Rebaked, where the last time I played, I had quite the migraine trying to play it, I guess. But this time, I'm actually back, and I collected 205 of these plumbing gummy jellies in my off time. Now, what does that mean? Well, I'm going to go straight to the bakery. No, no, no. It's actually a shop. What am I talking about? And I can purchase more life slots. Now, I don't know why they cost it a plumbing 100, but now I can purchase... It costs 150. Oh my gosh, I didn't know it would get extra- uh, Whatever, whatever. I'm still gonna- I'm gonna keep on going. I'm gonna- I did- I pressed the wrong thing. I'm gonna scream. Okay, I just, uh, pressed the flag button that was on the little scratch turbo warp or whatever to the screen. And apparently pressing that, that just resets the game. And luckily it saves my progress, so that's actually pretty cool. But I'm gonna try the challenge mode. I'm gonna see if this extra life can actually help me in any way, shape, or form. Uh, and if it does, that'd be great. Uh, is that supposed to be, like, a gender rape shadow? Because, like, I know it's obviously supposed to be, but, like, he's smirking and this pleb ain't. I don't know. It does say oven break in the wall, though. So, I just have to try my hardest at this. Now, also, in between what happened between the uh, last episode, at least the last time that I played, I've gotten some advice where, uh, it specifically has to do with the plebbing hook jumps. If there's a hook jump, but there's an obstacle in front of me, I have to take it. But if there's a hook jump, and there's no obstacle in front of me, don't take it at all. Because that's just going to lead to a certain death. So just to be sure, I'm probably going to like not take any hook jumps. Unless if there's like an actual obstacle in front of me that I can quickly recognize. See, like there was none right there. And, uh, okay, how fast do you go? Okay, that was somewhat fast. Uh, but hopefully this extra life slot can give me a little bit more leeway. Uh, I, I didn't even take it. Oh! Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Sheesh. I think I'm doing better than the last episode somehow, but I don't want to, like, I don't want to say that too fast. Is, I, is this, is this somehow increasingly faster? Oh my lord, if it's this fast, I can only imagine what the plumbing next, uh, two sections of the, ooh, that was close. I can only imagine what the next sections are like, because plumbing, that's going to be a major yikes. Oh, I think I'm getting a reasonable amount of, like, more gummies here. Like the plumbing jelly bear things. Uh, just be careful with the hooks. Uh, because, uh, I'm pretty sure just doing this in the prologue? Or is it training? I think it's training. Uh, I've been getting, like, I don't know, just, uh, probably, like, at a bare minimum, like, five gummies. And, like, now I'm getting a lot. Woo! Oh, this is going fast-paced now. Oh, lord. Oh, sheesh. Oh, this is gonna be terrifying at, like, section four. I didn't- And that was- If you blinked, you would miss that. I swear, that's how fast this is going. But you know what? For a first run, not doing the worst, I still have both my lives. I'm just missing a lot of gummies because I'm missing a lot of the hooks, but I feel like that's better just so I could stay alive. Okay, up here, and we're fine. Really doesn't look like much of the level has changed. However, I gotta be honest, as long as I'm staying alive and we're about to enter uh, section four right uh, right around here, if I can just get, an oh, I can get another freedom. Uh, okay, oh my lord. Oh, this is, oh, oh, I can't, oh my lord. Oh, this is like a treadmill. Oh no. Okay, there's the freedom. Nice. Oh my lord, all the gummies, though. Sheesh! Uh, plumbing, if I blink, I have to keep my eyes open the whole time. I, I even jumped over that. That's how, like, plumbing fast this is. Like, I can literally just jump over the hooks that have the obstacles. Oh my lord. Whew. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, wait, there's a rocket. Okay, what does this mean? I got a B ranking because of that, which is a new record. And I also got what looks like Ginger Brave and, uh... Is that a kitty? Is that Space Donut? No, that looks like a kitty. That would be, that would be a cool shot if it was like Space Donut. Because, you know, Rocket goes up in space. But that was actually very impressive. I honestly got a lot of gummies out of that. That was good for like the first run. But, uh, oh, and I unlocked Witch's Loop in Universe. Mm, I think I might focus this video on just challenge mode. Because th that was pretty hectic. And I didn't even lose a life out of that. That's impressive. Like, I didn't even have to lose, like, a single thing. Now, I could try and get, uh, S rank, which I'm pretty sure the best way that I can is if I, uh, try and get every single, like, uh, hook jump. But that's also implying that I don't get hit at all, because I'm pretty sure, uh, I have to reach, like, a specific point threshold to, uh, like, actually get the S rank. Which, to be fair, that makes sense, but I'm pretty sure it's all about just, like, staying alive at the end of the day. <laughs> which, now that I actually have, like, more lives... Which I know it's just one, but I also have the potential to get another one. 
I can probably do this way more fine. And don't I get... No, uh... Because I'm trying to think. Ooh, that was a nice hook. Because I'm trying to think, uh... If I finished the life with, uh... The puppy... Life. I finished the level with two lives. So, am I gonna get... I thought I jumped right there. Alright, just give me a uh, yellow E and I'll be fine. Just don't spawn in front of me, you monster. Uh, if I get... If, like, I finish the level with two lives, do I get, like, increased... I'm literally, I'm messing up, I'm throwing right now, because I'm messing up my plumbing uh, index and middle finger for the plumbing controls here. Uh, life would be a dream, or whatever the plumb, how that song goes, I don't know. Just give me a yellow E. Alright, let's keep jumping. I get that. Nice. Whoa, don't do it. I feel like my jump felt a little delayed, but I don't know. Okay, stop. Just don't give me the red E, because I'm not ready for that. Oh my... And of course, immediately, the next time I play, I lose. <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's try that again. I feel like I can at least beat this, like, one more time. Because there's no way I could just have, like, all that luck at the very first run. Stop. The fir Like, all the luck at the very first run, and then just everything else is just bad luck. I don't know. But, what was I even trying to say before? I think I was distracted by the flipping game. Uh, if I beat the level, but I have two hearts, does that give me like 10,000 points? Because I'm pretty sure beating the level with one extra life is like 5,000. I, I don't know. Maybe I could have noticed that in like, uh, when I beat the level, but I was just too enthralled. I, is that even the, the correct word to use? I don't know. But Really? I thought there would have been more distance. I, I know. I gotta like stop about the plumbing, uh, jump, like the plumbing hooking thing. I'm just trying to be greedy about it. That's my problem. Uh, anyway. Did I fall in the last run? I feel like I did, but I don't remember. And by the by the last run, I mean the first run. But I don't know. I just gotta be sure that I think you know what it is. Uh, when I try and jumping, uh, when I try to uh, jump immediately after uh, having sliding, there's a little bit of an animation for the sliding where I have to stand back up, so it kind of delays my jump. But still, that shouldn't deteriorate me that much. Is there an R right there? I'll be mad. Stop. All right, just give me one R just so I can get my life back at least. Because Lord knows that I need a life. There we go. And I guess a real... Uh, there you go. Finally you appear. A real big thing that can get you a lot of points is just getting those uh, jellies. Because literally, the the amount of points that you get just for uh, one gummy bear. That's what I'm trying to say. Little gummy bears. Which I'm probably just going to call gummies at this point. Because it's kind of easy to confuse gummies and jellies. But, yeah. Anyway. Just the plumbing one gummy bear... Like, that's the- that's literally the whole entire point that you get for a whole entire freedom. And freedom is plumbing, like, seven jellies that you need to collect. And you might not be- you may not even be lucky enough to, like, get them in chronological order. I don't think that's the correct term to use. But, you- you get what I'm saying. Just one plumbing bear jelly- I guess there'd be bear jellies. Just one of those bear jellies is enough for a whole freedom. And that can get you a lot of points if you're lucky- if you're lucky enough for those to spawn. So it's kind of a bit RNG-reliant. But it's whatever. Right now, I'm just focused on surviving. And also, I'm getting uh, some more memories, too. Which, uh, I'm surprised at how I didn't- Ah! Forgot about that. I was- <laughs> What- Was he gonna say, uh- Oh, I think, uh, I was gonna say something about, like, collecting the memories and stuff like that. I haven't done a video about, like, collecting those yet. Okay, just be careful of those. Never be too sure. Okay, good. Let's calm down for a bit. I think I've reached the end of the level again. I'm- f Okay, I threw again. <laughs> I swear, you know, I know, I understand, like, people, like, literally, there were people who told me tips. Oh, Rise, Rise actually got to the end. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if you do get two hearts, by the way, I got, I somehow got an increased ranking, which was a plumbing, uh, A, and I could try and reach for an S. Hmm, it might be possible. And now I got the, uh, portrait of Ginger Brave. Look, looking like they just smashed down onto the ground after they escaped from the oven. Which, hey, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna go for one more run, I'd say about, and I feel like that could make for a really good episode. But I will say, first of all, thank you all so much for uh, the plumbing advice. I'm pretty sure I mostly got it from my Discord server, but, uh, I, by the way, join the just Discord, by the way. It's a fun time, and whenever I ask for advice, all of you always come to my aid, because all of you are just so thankful, and I can't thank each and every one of you enough. But, uh, they told me the advice, you know, hey, you know, the hook, if you see an obstacle in front of it, you should hook. If you don't see an obstacle in front of it, don't don't hook. But it's kind of ridiculous because sometimes there will be an obstacle in front of it, but the camera is too far away to for, for me to notice the obstacle at all at first. So there's that problem. So sometimes it's just about like, you know, don't even hook at all because most of the time it's going to lead you to uh, demise and death. See right there? And the gummy was right there. 
But as you can see, my point exactly. Which, you know what? I... You know... I'm, I'm gonna ask the developers... The developers something real quick. What is the point of a waiting pause? Because at, at that point, you're just gonna, like, pause the game anyway. That's what I'm confused about. I'm just gonna restart that, because I'm gonna see if I can do, like, a... Even, like, I feel like... How do I say this? I had the full freedom, but then uh, I just got hit, so the next thing was just gonna give me an extra life and less points. So I messed up right there. I'm surprisingly not being too aggravated about this, though. By the way, why the plug does that sound play whenever I get, like, super close to an enemy? It's like it's some sort of a frog croak or something. Like, ah! You can see, like, that right there. But I know it's implying, like, oh, you nearly touched the enemy, but, like, I'd rather... I'd rather just focus on running. <laughs> like, it's fine enough that I, like, didn't hit the enemy. I don't want to be, like... I don't want to have it noted that, like, oh, almost touched it. Be careful. Oh! Oh, I hate this so much. Okay, one more time. Even right when I say, oh, I'm not getting aggravated. This, what are you talking about? I gotta just never, I should just never hook. Because, you know, now that I realize it, even if I didn't hook, every single jump that kind of required a hook, they were always possible. Okay, that was just the throw right there. I feel embarrassed about myself for that one. Please don't make fun of me. I swear I'm a good cooker on player, I promise. I'm just too focused on the commentary. I'm too focused and enthralled on everything else. Let me at least be... Alright, now this game is messing with me. Now that I... That was intentionally put in by the programmers. I tell you, that was intentionally put in. There is no possible way that wasn't put in as a meme. As a troll. I literally got hit less than a second in! That's just rude! I'm convinced that was put in by the developers. I'm convinced... See, like this, look at that, a perfect arc over, like, like, that was an arc of jellies, perfectly over the enemies. But plubbing, I just start the level up, and it's just two flaming gingerbread plubs ramming straight at me, and I instantly lose at the first second, that, you can't, you can't, and so, one of the, uh, probably developer, I'm pretty sure, even told me that, uh, there's harder levels later on, which, if that's the case, Kill me already, because my lord, if this is already difficult as it is, which I'm lucky enough that I even beat twice already, then I'm just shocked. But I just gotta keep on pushing. Doesn't matter how fast everything's starting to go. I missed the E. Literally, th that E was the only thing that I needed, but luckily I got another one later on, so that's fine. Uh, everything is going by so quick. Oh, I feel like, imagine if this, like, imagine a form of, like, cooker run, but, like, it's in VR. Everything is, like, virtual reality. That would make me vomit so badly. I don't even have a VR headset, so hopefully that day doesn't come. I mean, cooker run games are slowly evolving. We're soon gonna get one officially on the PC. Like, I know, you know, fan games like this and also, uh, blue stacks and stuff like that. Or, LD player. I didn't even need to- Oh my lord. I threw that one again, but I have to keep going. Uh, I completely forgot because I was too focused on talking about, like, you know, there's a cooker and game coming to the PC, officially. Might be on Steam. But, uh, it's specifically, it's Oven Smash, which, obviously, once that game comes out, I gotta play that because that sounds like a real fun game. It's, like, I think it's, like, a combination of, like, League, Fortnite, and... The, what the plug was that sound? I think it's, like, a combination of League, Fortnite, and also, uh, you ever, you ever play Sonic Adventure 2? You play, like, the Knuckles or Rouge level where you have to find the plebbing chaos that rose in the ground because you're trying to find hidden treasure. Yeah, I think it's also going to be like that. That's the only other thing that I can compare it to because that's one of the plebbing game modes. Oh, that was close. Just give me, just give me all the loot in the world. Honestly, just give me a bunch of gummies at this point. Really? You know, you didn't have to do that game. At least let me plebbing beat this level. If, there's, if I'm not going to get the plebbing S rank, then, like, obviously, I got to just go through this a couple more times. Just to, uh, plug and get all the, uh, memories. And what are memories? Those are the plumbing portraits that you get at the end of the level. And once you get basically all of them, all you're rewarded at the end of the level, instead of a memory, is a big old plate of jellies. Which I don't even think that improve- I, mean, uh, I don't think it increases your score at all. No, okay, so apparently if you have two lives- Oh, look at that buff plub right there. Apparently if you have two lives, it does not count. You would still get only one. So apparently as long as I finish the plubbing thing with one- Well, actually, so it doesn't matter. Because I would still, like, waste points. I would waste 2,000 points by getting the freedom. Because I would just refill a life slot. I- I- I don't know. I don't know what's the optimal strategy here. I know at some point I need to get the S rank. I need to prove myself as the best oven break rebake player of all time. 
maybe the only player i don't know but i'm just gonna end the video right here i'm probably gonna like do another video and hopefully in the next video that i do i probably get enough gummies just so i can get the new life but if you did enjoy this video then please be sure to leave a like on it and also share it with the, share it with your friends more kicker on content and if you enjoy my content in general why not subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't yet or you want to hit the bell to be notified of whatever i do in the future i also have merchandise if you want to check it out but i'm not forcing you to buy anything at all and also i have a discord down in the description as i mentioned earlier because it's a fun time down there and we try and expand each and every day and it's filled with a Hopefully it's filled with a bunch of people that you might be interested in talking to because it's great down there. Uh, but above all else, I will see you into these guardians in the next video. Hail the hype niece.